hardware for the Abilene electric guitar, Strat style, 80s, and um, obviously it takes a while to clean, so that is a pickup screw or a height adjuster screw for the single coil pickups, removing the surface rust. Um, as you know, it's easier to do this than it is in your fingers. That's what I've cleaned so far. And that's what I've got to do. These here hold down the bridge. Well, it, it is a uh, um, Tremel bridge. So. I did manage to find two new ones. They're just a tiny bit bigger. But overall length and thickness is the same, just the head's a little bit bigger than the new ones. And um, regarding these, for the pick plate, they are smaller. In the head size. So, compared to the other ones. So I'm cleaning all this up. Um, this is for the selector switch. Not, I can't remember what those are for. I'll probably remember later on. That's for the tuning keys, obviously, for the top of the neck. Spacer, basically. Just got that one to do. So, I have managed to clean all this up. Get all these pots working, because one of them was seized. One of the juniors was seized. I had to take the backings off to clean them. Um, the coils are placed inside with wax. And um, you can see where I've cleaned the tops of the magnetic rods for the coils. That's your pickups there, actually. So I will use a rubber glue to glue these back on the back of these. I still haven't used a multimeter on this yet, which I will do. Oops. And I stick some screws onto there. Great. I still haven't cleaned that off yet. I've managed to replace uh Most flattest fret on the neck, but the the fretboard is so dry that it's starting to cause damage, as you can just tiny little bit see. I still haven't tapped that in yet; it's just pressed in. It is an old fret that I'm putting in, but it's in really nice condition because, as you can see, some of these. Other frets are quite flat compared to that, and they will call those spots when you're trying to play. And that one there, the first one, will probably cause a buzzing sound. But um, I'll see how many old frets I've got to replace and see if they will stay in because I still have to clean the fretboard and um, give it a. I've got to get some whack beeswax which I don't have cost money because you know this is just a hobby it's not a, a business so I don't buy things I don't I'm not going to use over a long period of time because it'll just go off and be waste so 
so. Mm. I've been up for a while. It's the times now. Quarter to six. Six of December, twenty twenty-two. I have to go out and get something to eat later. <laughs> <laughs>